last night was the beginning. The tides of revival. And, 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 and you have the early tide. And the early tide, God has people selected for the early tide. The awakening tide. The tide that's not so impressive. But God has some people who are selected for the early tide. I call them early tide disciples. Shitikabahanda. Somebody said it to me, early tide disciples. So I am, I, am, I am reminiscing with the Lord about this sermon last night about the, the tide of the revival, the tides, the low tides, the, the anchor tide, the, the knee tide, all the way up. And I'm reminiscing and God said, look in my word and you will see the early tide decide. Wow. You better beg God your name is in it. God said, look at those fishermen. Those nobodies. Never been to seminary. And Jesus looked on one and said, follow me. Come on. And one went and called his cousin. And then I went and called his brother. Come on, somebody. They were early tied. Disciples. Come on, come at me, come at me. They were early tied. Disciples. Then you had Lazarus. Are you with me, somebody? Anybody heard about Lazarus? Then you had his sisters. Come on. Then you had Mary. Am I right? And you had Martha. Are you with me, somebody? I believe Mary, what about Mary? Mary is the one that to sit at Jesus' feet. Am I right? And then Martha loved to be in the kitchen to feed Jesus and feed the people and feed the children. And they want to begin to feel something. You're not talking with me, somebody. Then, then, then the Lord take me and you have one called Con Hold it. One called Cornelius. He was of a different culture. Some of the early time disciples said to me, early time disciples, Cornelius was from a different culture. And God told Paul, it's time to go beyond your boring culture. So God called Cornelius in the spirit and the same way God was speaking to Peter in the spirit uh, God spoke to Cornelius in the spirit and said go here <laughs> at a certain time and God told Peter go to this house at a certain time and when you open the door you will see another early tide Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Ah! Ah! Shut up! Anybody feel like you cannot begin to fit? Then God told Paul, he said, Go to a place called Macedonia. And, and, and God showed him a vision. And in the vision he saw a man calling him. You know why God let a man call him? Because folks don't believe in women preachers. I'm going to get in trouble here. Somebody. Somebody. I mean somebody. And he had that problem. So God caused him to see a man call him. So he get up to go to Macedonia. When he arrived in Macedonia. He saw a woman. And she was called Lydia. Come on, somebody. So in the early tide revival, you have Cornelius. Come with me. You have Mary. Help me. You have Lazarus. You have the disciples. And you have Lydia. Lydia.
Lydia was there waiting to receive God's servants. She was concerned about the welfare of the church. Concerned about the welfare of the new leaders. Concerned about this thing that came to town. She didn't want to stay in the hotel. She said, stay in my home. Ooh. The Lord began to deal with me. And said, these early tide disciples are here in Florida. And we sanctify you in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. The Lord dealt with me. We sanctify you. In the name of Jesus. There are some people who God has prepared for this revival. He has prepared some fishermen. Uh, he has prepared some cousins, uh, some brothers. He has prepared some Cornelius. He has prepared some Marys. Uh, he has prepared some Marthas. Come on, somebody. He has prepared some Lydias. Come on, somebody. Here, Lord of God. And here, and here it is. He has prepared you. <laughs> if you give me more time, I will show you only a name you can find there. On your name, you wouldn't find there. You find everything about you that God has designed for this revival to impact the earth. And God has supernaturally chosen you as an early tide disciple of the tides of revival. And at this early stage, God has chosen you. Because you can handle it. Stand up, everybody. Raga shata da bahaya. Shiba ha shaka da baba. Raga bahanda da baba. The Lord dealt with me very strong. You gotta recognize those. Glory to God. We thank God for Brother John, who's in every service. Amen. Amen. We thank God for. For, for Sister Sheila. Somebody told me about Sister Sheila and Sister Mimi and, and Brother Delgadio and many, many more names that come on somebody. All of the names that came. And God has supernaturally chosen you. Some from New York, some from Jamaica, some from Florida, uh, some from, 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 from Georgia uh, and all over, all over, all over. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. And the Lord is saying, allow him to work on you. Glory to God. Before I pray, before I pray, I just want to hand a little token here today. Is Sister Sheila here? Sheila, come Sister Sheila, come. I'm going to hand you this thing. Here's what it's called. It's called Harvest Army World Revival Impartation Emblem. It's for you. Amen. God bless you. Where's Brother Delgado? Come, Brother Delgado. Come, come. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. Come back, Sheila. Come back, Sheila. Stand right here, Sheila. Come on. Yes, Harvest Army World Revival Impartation Emblem. Glory to God. Where's Sister, where's sister Mimi? Is she here? Or she run off to work? Glory to God. Tell her to come out to the kitchen, you see? <laughs> I just told you about the one in the kitchen. Who was it again? Martha. Am I right? Go get Martha. <laughs> Glory to God. Come, Sister Martha, me, Martha. Glory to God. I must leave you there. This is the Harvest Army World Revival Impartation Emblem. Hold it. Glory to God. That's for you. Where is Brother John? You went off? Glory to God. All right. We'll do Brother John next week. It's somewhere here. Yeah, here. Listen. Shut your hands towards them right now. Father, in your mighty hand, Lord, you have spoken so strong. So strong last night, Lord, 
about the tides of revival and the different levels of the tides and the kind of people who you would send hallelujah in the early tides there are people who are specially made by you ordered by you trained by you prepared by you there may be things to work on but lord they are the material that will succeed in this revival in this world revival awakening in this world revival explosion or I, I minister unto them right now in the name of Jesus I rebuke the enemy I rebuke every attack of the devil that would seek to divert them from this call on their life as they stand in the gym Lord they have been waiting for this move of God that they will stand as pillars my God in this move of God and those who are not able to be here some from Sarasota some from lower from southern Miami some from other parts of Florida some from Daytona Beach and, and Palm Bay and from and from Tampa and from and from all these areas from Kissimmee and, and from the city oh from the city of, of Orlando I cover them on their blood right now from the crown of their heads to the sole of their feet as they arise as early died disciples for revival. Somebody say in Jesus name. God bless you. God bless you. Run back to your seats. My God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, come on John. Come on John. Come on John. Come on. Come John. Come, John, come and get your stuff. Okay. All right, you go and give John. Go and give John. Get him, get him on camera. Come on. Go ahead, go give John. My God, my God. That's how it is. Isn't that something? Isn't that something? John, Mimi, Louis, Sheila. Come on. And others from all over. Come on. Somebody say amen. Somebody give God praise. My God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Lift up your hand and give him praise. Lift up your hand and give him praise.